Hello everyone, I welcome you all for SVK tutorials. So in this video, I am going to discuss uh, a new topic called modified Euler's method or also called as modified Euler's method. So which is uh, one of the easiest uh, uh, method to solve the problems of initial value problem by using uh, numerical methods. Under numerical methods, uh, this is one of the method uh, called as modified Euler's method. So you consider any differential equation uh, like uh, dy by dx equal to a function of x, y with the initial condition f of y of x naught equal to y naught. Then we need to find y at x1 where x1 is given by x naught plus h or also h is nothing but called as step size. If uh, we want to find the step size, we are going to use x1 minus x0. So first we are going to apply our Euler's formula. By Euler's formula, so we have the Euler's formula as u y1 upon 0 which is equal to y0 plus h f of x0 comma y0. So what is Euler's formula? Euler's formula just it is y1 upon 0 which is equal to y0 plus h into f of x0 comma y0. Then after finding the uh, Euler's formula, so then we go with the uh, modified Euler's formula. We are going to extend this by iterative method. So we are going to find out y1 upon 1 which is equal to y0 plus h by 2 times of f of x0 comma y0 plus f of x1 comma y1 upon 0. So then we continue this uh, procedure again to for uh, second approximation. That is uh, y1 upon uh, 2 is given by y0 plus h by 2 times of f of x0 comma y0 plus f of x1 comma y1 upon 1. Whichever, whatever you have been so solved here, the value will be substituted here. So similarly, y1 upon 3 will be equal to y0 plus h by 2 times of f of x0 comma y0 plus f of x1 comma y1 upon 2. So we continue this procedure until unless we get an approximate solution when I compare with the previous value. So this is the procedure of uh, solving the problem of uh, Euler's method. So now let us see how to solve one of the problem of uh, this method. So now consider the problem solve y dash of x. y dash of x is nothing but dy by dx which is equal to 3x plus y by 2 with initial condition y of 0 equal to 1 then find y at point 2 then find y of point 2 with step size h equal to point 2 using modified Euler's method or Euler's method. So first of all you need to write down all the given data. So the given data is dy by dx which is equal to 3x plus y by 2. I will name this uh, given dy by dx as f of x comma y with initial condition x0. How to identify this x0 means y of 0. Whatever this value y of x0. This is represent x0 here. So 0 represents x0. So x0 equal to 0. And y of 0 equal to 1. This 1 represent y0. Y0 equal to 1. So we need to find out y of 0.2 equal to question mark. We need to find this value. So you can verify the value h here step size whether it is uh, the step size is uh, proper or not. So the given value x0 is 0 and the given value we need to find the value x1 it is 0.1. So h is given by x1 minus uh, x0 so which is nothing but 0 0.1 uh, sorry 0 0.2 minus 0 which is equal to 0 0.2. So then find out f of x0 comma y0 so which is equal to then first find out f of x0 comma y0 before applying in uh, Euler's formula or uh, Euler's formula find out f of x0 comma y0 what is the value of x0 0 what is the value of y0 1 so f of 0 comma 1 I need to find out which is equal to uh, just in place of x, x I am substituting x0 in place of y I am substituting y0 what is x0 value 0 what is y0 value 1 just substitute these two values here. So I am going to get 3 into 0 plus 1 by 2 which is equal to 0 0.5. 
I got the value of f of x0, y0. So now by Euler's formula, we know the Euler's formula y1 upon 0 is equal to y0 plus h into f of x0, y0. Just substitute the value of y0 here. You know what is the value of y0? 1 plus h value you know that is 0 0.2 into f of x0, y0. Just we now find out that value is 0 0.5. So solving this equation, we are going to get y1 upon 0 as 1.1. So this is by y1 upon 0 is by Euler's formula. Now moving on to modified Euler's formula. Modified Euler's formula. So y1 upon 1 will be equal to y0 plus h by 2 times of f of x0 comma y0 plus f of x1 comma y1 upon 0. Whatever the value I am going to get here y1 upon 0. Substitute that value in this equation. Similarly, continue this procedure until unless you get the approximate solution. So, therefore, the approximate solution is y of 0 0.2 equal to 1.16842. So, this is the way of solving the problem. Okay. Don't think that I am going to stop this problem here itself. And now, I am going to explain really how to solve this problem in simple manner by using your calculator. Take out your calculator now. Yeah, I think uh, you all take out your calculator. So first clear all the memory in your uh, calculator. Just uh, press shift 9 then press 3 press equal to clear all the memory. So now go for fixing for 5 decimal shift mode then you have fix here 6 press 6 then out of that <coughs> fix a range called 5 decimal now the calculator has been fixed for 5 decimal first type the function f of x comma y what is the function we have 3 alpha x plus y by 2 that is alpha y this is what y divided by so I have typed the equation called f of x x comma y. Now I will find out what is f of x not comma y not. So which is nothing but just press calci give x not value. What is the value of x not? Zero press zero equal to then give y not value that is one press one equal to. So you got the value of f of x not comma y not as what? 0.5. Retain this as it is. Don't do anything in your calculator. Now type this expression. Now I will be typing. I will be solving Euler's formula. Euler's formula is what? Y0 value is what? Y0 value is 1 plus H value is what? 0 0.2 multiplied with what? F of X0 comma Y0. Just now I calculated. So just press answer then press equal to then press sd you will get the value of y1 upon 0 that is Euler's formula 1.1 this is what the answer for Euler's formula now moving on to modified Euler's formula so now I am going to calculate these values and I will tell you how to calculate these values by using your calculator so now I am going to find out y1 upon 1 how to find out y1 upon 1? You know y0 value. Just type that value. y0 value is what? 1 plus you can uh, look at the data. Uh, already uh, given data. y0 value is 1 plus h by 2 value is what? h value is 0 0.2. 0 0.2 divided by 2. 0 0.2 divided by 2. Come out of this by moving joystick. So open the bracket f of x0 comma y0 already you have solved and you have written f of x0 comma y0 value that is 0.5 type that 0.5 value plus uh, after typing f of x0 comma y0 value plus f of x1 comma y1 upon 0 you need to go to the question and type in place of x1 as the value what is x1 has been known for you the x1 value is what here 0.2 this is what x1 value x1 value is 
point to wherever you have x type the value of x as point 1 wherever you have y type the value of y as answer in your calculator did you got so what i am going to do in place of x i will type the value of uh, x uh, x1 and in place of y i will type the value of y as answer that's what i am going to do now see here in place of <coughs> 3 times of point 2 3 times of point 2 plus answer divided by 2 i will take a fraction answer divided by 2 so then come out of this close the bracket just press equal to and press sd i got the value as what see here 1.16500 that is what y1 upon 1 similarly i will substitute y1 upon 1 here in this expression so in place of a y y i am going to substitute y1 upon 1 in place of x i will be retaining x1 as it is so for that reason just already i have an ready made equation just if i press equal to i am going to get the solution as what 1.16825 similarly if i press equal to i am going to get 1.16841 similarly if i press equal to i am going to get 1.16842 so for my clarification i am going with one more approximation i got the same solution so that's why i will stop this approximation to get the exact approximate solution for the given differential equation that is y of at y of point 2 i got the solution as 1.16842 this is the easy way of solving modified euler's or euler's formula so this is one of the best method of solving this problem if you have any doubts to solve this you can uh, put a message put a comment i will clarify your doubts at any stage i thank you all for watching my youtube channel those who like my youtube channel kindly do subscribe to my youtube channel thank you all for watching this